Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing an update on my deck planning project plan for April. If you aren't aware, this is based around a deck cards and a randomised table each month that updates depending on the card number and card face and whatever you pick and that is what the item is that you're going to work on. Anyway, before I get into that I just want to mention that hopefully next week I'll be back to normal and during my Friday and Sunday uploads I have just been having a few busy weekends in April and I just could not figure it out and work it out to make it possible around be working full time so um, yeah we should be back to normal on Friday next week so going into my deck of planning project update we do have one item that is going to be rolling out and then we've still got some steady progress with the other stuff so without further ado let's get into the main part of this video the first item we have is my Rimmel London Stay Matte Liquid Lip Colour in this shade Rosetto Liquido this I have used 10 times which is actually my usage goal so this is the item that we're going to be rolling out today and we will be replacing with a new item which is exciting, it's always great and I think I've been able to roll in anything for the last while so yeah this is awesome that I'm going to be able to roll something new in this month um, I actually really enjoy wearing this, this has kind of like been a go to uh, when I've worn makeup, which hasn't been very much, not gonna lie, I have been struggling to wear makeup these, these last few weeks. Um, I have been away and I've not really wanted to wear makeup every single day. So, yeah, neutral nude shade, which kind of works well for me. And um, it is a matte lipstick, but it's not drying. So, it actually worked out quite well. Anyway, we are gonna roll this one out today and I will look forward to wearing that again in the future at some point. The next item we have is my Cha Cha Cha, no, my, not my Cha Cha Cha, my, my Cha Cha Tint uh, Blush by Benefit in the shade Mango. This is a tinted lip and cheek stain. I only really use it on my cheeks though. This is of course, I think probably a little sample I got many years ago. I have used this uh, one time this month, a total of six times, so we still have four more uses until I can roll this out, which I reckon could happen if I wore makeup more regularly, but I have not been wearing makeup regularly enough. This is still going. I can actually now see in, in the camera that we are about here. We've got this much product left in here. So we're getting close to the end, well closer to the end anyway. Um, so we are still keeping this in. This was in for the prompt multi-purpose by the way. I should probably mention that the lip product was in for the prompt matte. So that's what I told you there. The next item we then have is my MUA Undress Your Skin Highlighter, which is this one. As you can see, um, this was in for the prompt pattern and the pattern is very much still here i have used it two times this month a total of eight times we're going to keep this in until the pattern does disappear which i think will probably mean that this is in the entire year um and we probably won't roll this one out because um i won't get to that point i don't think but yeah, this is where we are at progress wise. Um, I feel like it has got a little bit flatter like down here. I probably need to work on this side a little bit more because I definitely feel like I've been paying more attention to this side. So it's a stunning highlighter though. I do like wearing it. Um, but I just have not been picking it up enough. I especially have not been taking it away beyond holiday, which probably would have helped if I took any of these items away with me, but I have not and I'm not planning to this next week either so then for the prompt most recent purchase I rolled in this this is a cleansing powder by Tropic now that I've figured out how you work it you basically uh, shake some of this into a pot and then you put in like a drop or two of water mix it up and then it kind of goes into a foam and I've actually managed to make it work this time. I have used this a couple of times this month, I've used it, well, two times and I've got it 
to the point of using it seven times in this project so three more uses and then we can roll this one out um it's not my go-to i have been wearing or using other um more travel safe and travel better uh, makeup removers instead so i haven't really been picking this one up or taking this with me so as you're seeing this i will not be in the country um i'm filming this pre-going on holiday but um if i yeah i'm not taking any of these items with me um i'm not taking this one with me because i don't find it very travel safe i feel like as it's a powder and i feel like it's just a little bit wary i actually prefer taking uh wipes with me when i'm on holiday which is kind of like something i don't ever really would use and also like little um little makeup remover pots uh, I think I'm using like an Elemis one at the moment. Anyway, that is the update with that one. So yeah, I'm not taking this with me uh, or any of these. I'm not taking the highlighter with me either because the packaging is broken. And I don't trust this on the flight. So there's the tea with that. Finally, for the last item I have rolled in for Hazapan, I rolled in my first ever bronzer I've ever owned, which is my Bourjois Bronzing Powder, and it has got a little pan in it, and I plan to use this 10 times. I have used it currently three times this month, a total of six times in this project. So four more uses and then we can roll this out. I'm also not taking this one on holiday with me either. So this is also not going to get as much usage as I would have liked in the next couple of days for the next month, but we move on. So with that being said, those are where I'm at with the five items. I am going to roll out this item now. I actually haven't looked at it. I notoriously just don't look at the spreadsheet anymore to like see or hope what I'm going to get so it's completely random so I'm just going to um, shuffle the cards and we will see what we will get I'm just gonna have a brief look whilst I'm shuffling all right ready the queen of clubs that is a face card that is a pick your space okay nice let's see pick your own space pick a space on the main board but it must match the suit you've drawn okay so i can pick any of the items from the clubs okay that's awesome okay okay for clubs i have the option for SPF, Glittery, Influencer Collab Brand, Favourite Colour, Focus, BOMB, Influenced, Dethroned, or Affordable. Okay, so I have decided I am going to work on the Conspiracy Palette, which was a collaboration between Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson. I don't really follow or like care about any of those two, right, two people anymore, but this is the palette. Um, I don't quite know what goals I'm going to set out for this one yet, but this is what we're gonna work on. Um, I will let you guys know probably in the next update what I've chosen what to do with this, but um, yeah, this is the item I'm gonna roll in and work on. And with that being said, that is my video. And I hope to see you guys in my next one on Friday. Bye guys.